Hi everyone, Madonna here and Joy. We're going to do a bit of a stress circuit because uh, my health hasn't been well. Health hasn't been the best and, and predominantly a fair bit of anxiety and panicky and uh, let's just say some mental health sort of stuff going on. So let's just see if we can reconnect some of the pathways in Joy's brain. That would be good. I might be connected. <laughs> the wrong things. Hold up. Oh. And uh, and oh. one of my things, I'm a guilt girl. Hold. Oh. And Joy was just saying that lately she's been feeling a lot of guilt oh. as well. Listen, I've got besides in that shoulder. I don't know if anything you're doing. I'm bloody make it happy. Hold. Oh, it still works, but oh. that's survival, deep survival, and hidden deep survival. So, besides or not. Without any stress, hold, it works. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> uh, so there is. Your adrenals are on overload and there's survival, deep survival and hidden deep survival happening. Mm. So that ends up making your brain feel like you're the deer in the headlights all the time. Right. And Doug's not helping. Yeah. If I ask Doug if we go and ask Josh to carry the groceries in, they'll be too heavy for either of you. Bloody eight or nine. Mm -hmm. And I've got bursitis in most of my bloody joints. <laughs> anyway, instead of doing that, I'm not asking him. So he'll go and do it all himself and then tell us that to himself. You to help. I wasn't asking you to do the work. Oh, I know you. You do your dead work and do that. You've got, you, <laughs> you got another thing up there. Same one for the last six months. Oh, I can't see any of the little trees and shit on it tonight. It's not on. Ah. Mm. So I've got the mood lighting going over there. All right. Just put you in a good mood or a bad mood. <laughs> it's over good mood. I just want to be, just want to check what you're after. So your periventricular survival system is overloaded. Your brain just wants to run away. So more weekends up at Jimmy's place would be in order. Oh, no, sometimes that's as bad. <laughs> I think I came home and told Josh this. <laughs> <laughs> Did he have two sherries? <laughs> no, I didn't mean he was pissed. I was pissed off because I, because I thought the grandson at home was probably less difficult than grandson we'd have. <laughs> <laughs> JB wasn't bad or anything, he's just full on 24 hours a day. And he's absolutely darling, it's just that I'm not, you know, when Josh was a little crikey, what was it, bloody 42? Not 42 anymore. Mm -hmm. That was 33 years ago. <laughs> Darn grandkids, I don't know. Exhausting. So I'm just working through the nuclei in your brain that are stressed up. So part of your brain is, um, yeah, the, um, and I think because of the break-in, there's sort of all this vigilance going on in the nervous system. So your nervous system's just wired for stress at the moment. So I'm just trying to calm that down. You sleeping? Nobody knocks on the door half mm. an hour after I'm asleep, and I think decent people should be asleep, even me. But of course, that'll probably stop your sleep pattern. Mm -hmm. Mess it up, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, however much you're ready to have a sleep and think you would have had a sleep, or you're still wondering if half an hour after you go to sleep, something will wake you up. That's all. Oh, okay, we need a flower essence. So bark, bush, bush. I get plenty of barking at home. <laughs> um, so it's turkey bush. Turkey bush is about an inability to problem solve. So it's when, you know, because when the vigilance is there and your body's nervous, your nervous system's overloaded, 
all we're thinking is, ah! <laughs> with four drops, it's a fairly decent dose. So it just helps your brain to come up with a more creative solution. Extra one for later. Okay. So with this stress, how's your body been feeling? <laughs> so is the body feeling worse these days? With all this stress? Sinus. Yeah. I did a lot of the Pilates and yoga on my back. Mine on, certainly would have been much more strengthening to be yeah. in these bits. Had I been on my hands and knees. Yeah. Just couldn't make it happen. Well, Hold I, in for didn't, me. I didn't till a Either one of my pieces just refused to cooperate anymore. Yeah. So I did it. I probably did the first half of it. Well, maybe three quarters. I mean. Yep. No, I well done. I wasn't looking at the clock because it mightn't have been one. But when it just got too bad, I just lay on my back and did the exercises that I was supposed to be doing without, like, sort of upside down. Yeah. And with the cough, is it a dry cough? Is there is it mucusy? Like, are you bringing anything up? Oh, I put oh, that. I, when I was at the went to get the X-ray yesterday. Oh, that. Yeah. Um. I actually had some up, so I had had already had my little bottle, so I did had them there, and then I went over and and then she did the blood test as well, so I gave her. So she got two. And whatever I do today, I'll have to give that to her tomorrow. Oh, yeah. So I suppose I'll have pit up something before. Be a rare day if it didn't happen. Colour of the mucus? Clear, white, yellow, green? Not clear. Yeah. Not green. Yeah, so somewhere in the middle. Okay. I did not know. I'm, I'm sure that I shouldn't have that in, but after I had a shower this morning, it must. Oh, yeah, right. Ouch. So, um, God help us, I didn't know I was having a... Did you get sandfly bites up at Sunny Coast? Of course I got sandfly bites up at Sunny Coast. In relation to sandfly bites. But I had some stuff at home. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I went looking for the larium. Oh. When I got the larium, I discovered it was for... Oh. Mosquito bites, oh. I don't think. What's larium? Well, after I read the thing, I thought it must have been for... Um, malaria or malaria. something. Malaria. Yeah, right. Because, um, you know, sandfly bites, they're sort of like ticks. They release a bacteria into the bloodstream. That's why we can get infected if I'm we're sure susceptible. That, I don't know that you, the sandfly bites you get have a lot to do with where you're itchy. I mean, they might be, but... You oh, know, no, they're releasing a toxin into your bloodstream. So therefore it's in your blood. So the itch can be anywhere because then your white blood cells, um, there's a blood cell called an eosinophil, it starts releasing acid into the bloodstream. Because as far as I could see, there were bits of me that were, and they start. some of the things started on Saturday night. I'm pretty certain um, one of them would have got me on Saturday because we um, um, weren't in any... You know, usually it's at night time or it might be early morning or I didn't see any of that shit, did I? Yeah. I mean, if JB was jumping on me or anything, it was in the bed, not anywhere where a sand floor would get me. Yeah. Another rest circuit. Okay. I haven't had breakfast twice before for a long time. <laughs> Actually, JB and Jimmy and Doug and I... We really only had another cup of coffee or milkshake. Or... That kid is bad. He had a milkshake and something to eat, and then we all went for a bit of a walk and found Debbie. And when we came back, she had breakfast, and the rest of us had another drink, and he had another milkshake, and he drank the whole bloody lot of it. Oh, yeah, he's got 12 stomachs. <laughs> <laughs> So if he didn't, if he, if he decided he didn't want anything else, I thought, well, the kid's eating enough. 
I just got sick of his cornflakes and said he didn't need any more. I thought, fair enough, Archie probably needs cornflakes. auditory integration. Okay. So that was your auditory sensory um, is constantly on alert. My hearing. Yeah. Um, I don't know what you wanted me to do there. Yeah, it didn't work. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know if you wanted me to hold them out or in. <laughs> they tried and it didn't work. <laughs> Pain and punishment circuit. I don't think I was about to ask if you're going to come to Badeston on the 15th, but I think probably the 16th is when you need to come. Yeah. Beautiful. Another flower essence too. All about flower essence. Seven three. We saw a brush turkey on Wednesday night running across the road and JB pointed it out to me that there was a brush turkey and I had a look at it. And the reason it was running across the road so fast was because all these little birds were attacking it. But I hadn't seen any of the little birds. I was quite surprised the next day when I was saying that's what the brush turkey did yesterday. When all the birds chased me, I reckon no little birds were chasing it, I think. Yeah, right. It just amused me how... His brain must have been looking at something else. Mm. Three drops. What was that? Pine, it's for trusting and opening up. It's when people have pissed you off and you want to keep them at a distance. That's what happens when we go into a survival pattern, though. The brain just wants to stay vigilant and keep us safe. You switch other people's off. Oh, it's <laughs> <laughs> <is> the plan. <laughs> Bloody boys, hard to get them on the table. Yes. Okay, cool, cool. So we've calmed down your survival pattern, reintegrated the left, right sides of the brain. Your throat chakra, so. Interesting. Yeah, so your throat chakra was down. Damn Throat's what? about it wasn't working. So that's about um, you know energetically, it's about <laughs> saying stuff but worrying about the consequences. So it's hard just to be you at the moment and just speaking. So it's just hard Christ work. Almighty, the president, I offend some bastard every time I open my mouth. Exactly. So your throat chakra has been having a hard time. Yeah. Um, and also auditory, so it's your, you're worried about what you're hearing as well as what you're saying, so that's not going to be able to be um, helping good communication, it's not going to help good communication when there's a fear of both, a fear of saying something wrong <laughs> and a fear of what someone's going to say, they're both uh, vigilant at the moment, so we've calmed those down. Now, I would think if you hadn't had any drugs, and you told me that you did several drug tests so far, mm -hmm. obviously I didn't say anything about it. Anyway. All good. Thanks. See you later, guys. Hope you enjoyed that. Bye.